Hi my dishwasher Rio 3T123 6P UK Whirlpool stops and beeps shows a H on the screen, I'm not sure what the error is as I can't find a reference to a H error. Can you guesstimate how old your Whirlpool is? And just to clarify, what's the exact model? 6 months, Rio 3T123 6P UK do you plan on doing the work yourself? Depends on what needs doing. Anything else we should know to help you best? No. Hi, I'm Daniel. Welcome to Just Answer. I'm reviewing your question now and will post back with your reply momentarily. After the H, does any number flash up? Also when you reset it and start a new cycle how long does it run for before it does it again? No number, just a constant slow beep and the H displayed not flashing. Restart straight away and drains and I'm presuming start cycle again, probs about 5 minutes at most before beeping begins again. I would have expected a number if it was an error hence asking you now. If you look at the lights next to the screen are any flashing? If so then which ones are flashing? If not then try the auto test cycle and see what happens. Switch on with the on slash off button. Press the P button twice. Switch off with the on slash off switch. Press P again twice. Switch back on and close the door. Now it will run an auto test cycle so just see what happens from there and let me know. Started beeping again and now shows number 12 on display. Ok that's error code F12 which is a communication fault between the control board in the door and the main power board at the bottom. What you can try if you haven't already is completely unplug the dishwasher and leave it for 30 minutes as this will allow the compartments on the control board to discharge themselves. Then turn it back on and see how it goes from there. If it's still the same after this then I'm afraid it's looking like the control board is the fault. Now it's usually the main one at the bottom that causes the F12 fault but this isn't a DIY replace as the board has to be programmed up with the Whirlpool laptop. But as it's only 6 months old then I will assume it's still under its warranty with them. But try the unplugging first and just see how it goes from there. Ok cheers. You're welcome. If you have a home improvement or appliance question and want to chat with an expert now visit justanswer.com slash YTHI.